Hi and hello, welcome back. Jana here with a new process video for our Sketch Saturday series. And today was a bit um, difficult, a bit tricky and a bit, I don't know, I had a hard time to finish this page because I had um, a totally different idea in my head um, and I did not uh, work out and so I needed to work around uh, my um, first idea and yeah. Um, I um, did some pre-work. I just um, added some modeling paste through a stencil by Nunica to a piece of uh, white cardstock. This is around six by six inches. And I bought a new stamp set from um, All and Create. And it's this uh, gorgeous stamp with the butterflies and the bee. And I just wanted to have the butterflies on my paper and I also did uh, the stamping on vellum and I fussy cut um, the butterflies out so uh, my first idea was to create a layer layer it look on top of the um, cardstock uh, with the texture paste but it was not looking the way I imagined and so yeah, like I said before, I needed to change uh, some things. Um, this is also a new stamp set from um, All and Create, and I'm just um, adding some more stems, so so the edges are not that um, like a square, you know. And I just wanted to have some variations, and I so I just stamped some more onto the butterflies. Um, yeah, the piece of white cardstock with the texture paste. Uh, and yeah, I did a break and here you can see what I came up with. I um, added the piece with the texture paste on the right side from the paper and I tucked the wings underneath the white cardstock. So um, I still have the layered look, but not on top of the white paper. I added some black stitches and now I'm working with um, a Lindy's color called Wild Honey Suckle coral or something like that and I'm just um, adding some colors here and there. <clears throat> I will also add um, some splatters but uh, right now I'm just working um, around the butterflies and on top of the um, texture paste so that the um, stencil or the pattern will show a bit better and I will add some more colors as I go and uh, I totally love how this is looking so far. It's not what I wanted but I totally love it. And today is um, I created the sketch after I finished my layout just because I had um, yeah an idea but it was not working and so I skipped the first sketch and so I'm just, I just created a new one and um, yeah, I love how it's uh, coming together now. Um, here I decided to add um, a tiny bit of black um, down um, under the last butterfly and I will add some black splatters. And um, I wanted to bring in some floral elements and I had a look into my stash and I grabbed tons of flowers but nothing looked right and so I did some fussy cutting on a piece of um, uh, floral paper from AB Studio and these are just black and white and I totally love how this is, um, how they are looking uh, next to the butterflies. I will also add some more stitches around the 6x6 paper um, just because I had the feeling there's something missing. missing. And so I decided to add um, just some more stitching. And um, I will um, have a look into my stash again because uh, for some more embellishments and for my title. And it was, I don't know, it was not working like I wanted. But I decided to go with Make Today Count. And um, this is a mix um, from Amy Tangerine and Dear Lizzie stickers uh, from Alpha's Word stickers, you know. And um, the circle I'm adding right now, it's from Heidi Swap. And uh, I just used it, or I, I grabbed it. I, I, I'm using it because of the color. And um, I also got a new die um, or new die set from, let me check, um, Beatrice Garni. And it's um, the die set uh, Sweet Life. And I just um, added 
I'm just adding some black um, florets on the right side and uh, I will uh, also bring in some of these gorgeous light bulbs by P13 I believe and I'm just um, going with them because of the colors and I totally I just love to add um, these kind of uh, elements and yeah I just I just love it so now everything is glued down. I added some thread underneath the circle and I uh, sticked everything down with hot glue. And now I am nearly done. I will only bring in some animal dots and that's it for today. So you will get um, a close up and some final pictures at the end. And thank you so very much for stopping by. It really means the world to me. And I hope you're all doing good. And um, yeah, hope to see you soon. Thank you and bye bye.